हॅलो आय एम डॉक्टर मंजिरी वळसंकर डायरेक्टर भिडे हॉस्पिटल टेस्ट्यू बेबी सेंटर नवी पेठ पुणे टुडे इट्स अ कॉमन क्वेश्चन विच इज आज बाय माय पेशंट्स अँड देअर रिलेटिव्ह दॅट वेन एव्हर वी फ्रीज एग्ज ऑर एम्ब्रिओज ऑर स्पर्म्स टू इम्पॉर्टंट क्वेश्चन्स डू दे ग्रो फर्दर वेन दे आर फ्रोझन अँड द सेकंड क्वेश्चन इज will they be as good as they were when they were frozen at the time when we will be thawing them and getting them back to life and then transferring the embryo now let's tackle the first question it needs to be understood that this freezing procedure is a scientifically proven procedure which is known as vitrification vitrification or fast freezing is a process in which commercially available media is used to freeze the embryo or the oocyte in which the temperature is reduced from 37 degrees which is the mother's body temperature immediately within fraction of seconds to minus 196 degrees which is way too low sub zero degree temperatures now these eggs or these embryos when they are frozen have to be necessarily maintained at the temperature of minus 196 degrees with the help of commercially available medical grade liquid nitrogen so this liquid nitrogen system is the one which protects the embryo it prevents it from getting degenerated and after thawing the embryo the frozen embryo is again transferred from minus 196 degrees to 37 degrees with a procedure which is known as thawing and it is because of this thawing that the baby comes back to life Similarly whenever we freeze oocytes or eggs what we are doing is whenever we obtain the egg we are separating the m2 oocytes or the mature oocytes from the immature oocytes and these m2 mature oocytes are frozen with vitrification and stored under liquid nitrogen it can be stored even up to as far as 10 years the sperms are frozen for husbands who are apprehensive to give sample on the day of the wife's surgery or if the husband has to travel on the day of the wife's surgery the sperms are frozen by a slightly different method but again they are also kept under liquid nitrogen so whenever the sperms or the eggs or embryos are kept in liquid nitrogen they are under complete protection it prevents them from growing further or degenerating further and it helps us to get the best yield or the output once we get them back to life so there has to be no misunderstanding or misconception as far as freezing is concerned it's a very safe and an extremely potent method for storing the embryos eggs as well as sperms thank you